But I'll take this bitch to my house so I can fuck with it this weekend. Still got that CRX. Sick Matha gave it to me. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. For now, hope this bitch starts. I'm gonna drive it to my house. Hey, that's pretty good. So I've shown this car off a couple of times on Instagram and it looks decent in photos, but the paint is covered in like chips and shit on this hood. So I'm really worried about it because it has a couple dents. It doesn't look bad in photos, but the roof is all like hella ashy and shit. It needs some lotion. I don't know what the fuck's going on up there. And the paint clears all coming off. So I'm just gonna sand it down and then tomorrow we finna hit the junkyards up. We get some tail lights. Door handle broke, so I can only open it from the inside now. Whatever the fuck this is, I'm gonna go hopefully get one of those tomorrow too. I don't know if I'm gonna replace the bumper. I mean, this one's broken, but fuck it. Start sanding this side. I just hit this big ass dent. I don't know how I'm gonna get it out because I don't really have any like dent pulling tools or anything, or a rubber mallet or anything to put inside the door. But I have the back of this hammer. So I'm gonna try to whack on the door with the hammer, with the back of the hammer. See if I can pop that dent out. I don't know how well that picked up on camera, but it's way better than what it was. Just the only problem is now, I need a hole like right, right here so I can put that hammer in and just push it out. Like I know you'd be like, why don't you just get a dent puller? Because that's not how I do things. I'm fucking cheap and poor. So I'm gonna cut a hole right here. Get her out. It was a success, except for now the window's in the way. So I'm gonna lower the window and take it out and then try to punch out that dent. Such a pain just to get that window out. Kinds of dumbass brackets. It's not like an EF where you can just unbolt the window and it'll come straight out. Like this one's all like fucking jewed in there and shit. So, but now we can punch out that dent. So let's do that. I think that's about the best I can get it. So I'm gonna sand it all down and throw some Bondo on it. So it's a couple hours later. Just finished the Bondo on this door. I didn't record any of it because I'm sure there's hundreds of videos on YouTube, but I've got the rest of the car all sanded down. About to put the window back in. I'm gonna hose it off and uh, put the new wheels on. Or the old wheels that I painted that you guys haven't seen yet. All right, so this is with the coilover sleeves. I think the sleeves are maxed out. It's not good enough for me. So I'm gonna take it all apart and see if we can go a little lower. All right, this is the back maxed out too. Once again, it's not good enough. So we're gonna put top hats and take out that uh, the extra spring set here. I'll, I'll show you. So whoever took these shocks apart to put these coils on was a fucking retard and didn't put it back together right. I was just like, uh, look at that. I think he fucking stripped this out and was missing a, a piece that goes in there that prevents this from coming up. Most of you know what I'm talking about, but what a fucking moron. This one's supposed to be on there. That stops it from going all the way up. That's the one that's supposed to be on there, but I'm going to take this piece off. Is that about a half an inch? And then I'm going to put these extended top hats. Should give me like a, probably another inch, inch and a half lower. And then uh, I'm going to try to roll out this fender a little bit. I also have a uh, camera kits, but I don't think I'm going to put it on this piece of shit. So I got the top hats in. Check out that crap. It's sitting all right. It's not the best fitment ever, but I'm okay with it. Rolled the fenders out, so I shouldn't have any issues. I didn't really end that last video because it was uh it was late and I was trying to get the photos for Instagram. But so with the front sitting, I'm gonna raise it up a little bit. The back I gotta lower a little bit because it's like a it's hella gap. So I'm gonna take those extended top hats out the back. And uh, remember those custom ones I made? I'm gonna put these ones in. I don't know how low it's gonna make the car. I don't really want to cut the springs, but I mean if I have to, I guess I will. A little bit into this one, and uh, if you're watching this, this is the day that I put the poll on uh, Instagram and Facebook. So you can choose what color I'm going to paint this. But I'm going to start working on the hood and the trunk, because those might get rusted. I'm not sure yet, but I do need to sand the trunk down and get it ready for paint or rust. But, peace pants.